Here are my opinions on the ingredients of the new Sephora Blur It Loose setting powder. It is a talc-free powder. These are the ingredients. Of course, we have a synthetic floor flogopite base. We have mica, cellulose. That seems to be what the oil absorbing base is or the mineral base. We also have vinyl dimethicone, methicone, silsesquioxane cross polymer. We have methyl methacrylate cross polymer, dimethicone, diisosteromalate, magnesium muristate, caprylyl glycol. So we also have lower oil lysine, which I mentioned in this video um, is a spherical blurring powder. It is an amino acid conjugated to a lower oil group. I saw a fascinating video on here the other day that I reposted and it was talking about the hourglass concealer. And it was talking about how the hourglass concealer only works with some powders that have a silicone base. This has a silicone base. It has the vinyl dimethicone, methicone, silsesquioxane cross polymer. It has the dimethicone. It's going to sit on top of the skin and blur, I think a little bit more than the next one would. It's also not going to, I think, be everyone's favorite product. Like I think if you have silicone containing products in your routine this will work really well on top of those because it has silicone ingredients it's going to incorporate really nicely into really heavy silicone based concealers however i mean there's also just like minerals and there's a spherical amino acid powder there's color there's sodium hyaluronate so it's hydrating i think this is going to be a little thicker it's go it's like a silicone based powder if that makes any sense. I think this is a new category of powder that's going to come up now that talc free is a thing, but a lot, I, I'm going to tag the video I'm talking about down below where I'm talking about the hourglass concealer, but basically this is, it, it's going to be blurring. It's going to be a little more matte looking than the NYX if we're comparing the two of them, but I don't think this is a bad product. I just wonder how well over time it will absorb oil. I know it will be initially a little more matte than the next one and then a lot of other products.